first one, growing up, who was your childhood hero? Oh, um, I'd say obviously my dad, um, obviously someone who, who first got me to play football. Um, and then probably looking at Thierry Henry, which are the two, if you trade off um, Thierry Henry, a big Arsenal fan um, growing up. So obviously being the main Arsenal striker, record ball scorer, he was an easy one for me. Yeah. What made you say yes to Forest Green Rovers? Well, I've, I've actually seen them play and I've played against them a lot and they passed the ball really well, always had a great side. Um, again, the ethos of the club I was really interested in. So yeah, it just, it just pulled me to the club. What job would you do if you weren't a footballer? That's a tough one. Um, I've got a degree in psychology, um, which I did at uni just before I got into professional football. So I think um, if I hadn't got into football, I think I would have carried on that path and that would have been um, counselling psychologist. As a child, who was your, your hero, be it sporting or other? Ronaldinho. I have to say, growing up watching him, he was unbelievable. And I wanted to be like him. Obviously, I'm not in the same position as him, but he's just a fantastic footballer. What music do you listen to before a game? Oh, before a game, um, I tend to listen to a little bit of kind of hip-hop stuff, so stuff that's up, upbeat music, really. Um, something with a bit of tempo, just to kind of um, get me into into a mood and just relax and not really think of think of what was going to happen just um, relaxing over the floor who's your fashion icon <laughs> myself good <laughs> yeah. I, I don't really have a fashion icon i just try and dress as well as i can some people might not think that i do some people might i'm not sure but um yeah i have to be myself